Number eight. Wow. Yes, sir. <laughs> if you could time travel your strategies into the future. Okay. What safeguards would you put in place? Uh, do you know what I love about the future, about the past is, but is also a challenge, is human beings forget a lot. Yeah, we forget what great, I and we're arrogant, right? We forget what great ideas people had in the past. And we kind of belittle them and say, well, we're cleverer now. We won't make those mistakes again. But you know what? We're not that much cleverer and we do make those mistakes over and over again. And forget other human beings, you do it to yourself. I'm amazed at how many times I go back over my own thinking and think, oh, I'm a better thinker now. But actually, I'm pretty impressed by, you know, 20 year old Farris and the decisions he made or, or 30 year old Farris and the decisions he made. So, you know, what I would do in terms of time travel is sort of go back and forth in time and say, trust the other generations. Right. They've got some great content. They've got some great ideas. Right. You don't need to do all the heavy lifting and, th and, and think you are the superhero of every story. And I think that would put us in a in a much better place to listen more, explore what's come before us um, before just start, you know, throwing it all out of the, uh, the bathwater with the baby or the other way around.